I almost had to do it. I've been trying now for, I don't know, man. I got it all back together again. Uh, I had that uh, that Chinese knockoff 38 mil air striker. So I went and bought the real deal. And I just had, I mean, I, I had that other carburetor pretty good. It's a little bit on the bottom end. I didn't like it. Just kind of felt like it sputtered and blah, blah, blah. But uh, getting that new carb, I thought that was just going to be the answer to everything. Um, it's just been a pain to try to get it to, to, to get right. I mean, I've been fighting with this thing and fighting with it. Got it all put back together again now. Um, like I said, I, I was almost willing to take it somewhere and have them spend a couple hundred dollars and, and let them do it. But, uh, you know, you just got to persevere sometimes and... and uh, <laughs> just keep plugging at it uh i found an easier way i think to uh for me personally instead of snatching the carburetor out every time i uh, i just went at it from this way i uh, i knew i had my uh i knew i had my my uh god almighty i had my uh jetting right but i was just struggling with the needle i was struggling with the needle but uh now i just go in th through there without having to take that carb off i pull it off there take it apart there and uh and that's what pretty much saved saved me from saved me from uh taking it somewhere else but uh no i feel it's running pretty good now we're uh let's see what do y'all think it's uh not not bad not running bad at all oh one kick willie having a little problems with uh getting her neutral but uh it seems like she's running pretty champ though so uh now i got a little something else to work on gotta get that clutch right but other than that not bad it's not running hot so uh i think i've got my jet in pretty good I can read that about 160 159 160 so that's not bad 